I have to say that I consider to, this to be bullying. This is personal bullying. We're not talking about issues. We're not talking about things that are important to politics. We are making this personal. And I find that totally unacceptable. <laughs> and this is the way that the GSLP is running this, this whole entire place. I would not be lying if I said that you're not remembered fondly. Okay, so John, you, now that we're being so honest with each other, you, you will, you deny, will you deny the evidence that you have about I myself being subjected to some serious bullying by a minister. Do you deny I, that I, evidence that I you have, have in no, front of you? I have no evidence. When you travel abroad, you should make sure you switch on Wi-Fi and you switch off your roaming, because roaming is obviously extremely expensive, particularly if somebody else is the one who has to foot the bill. But um, I, I think, in, if I may answer that more broadly, I recall that some, you know, sometimes coming into politics uh, can be difficult. I remember that uh, when Fabian uh, decided to put his name down and became leader of the GSLP, he was subjected to all sorts of accusations, to all sorts of uh, character assassinations, to slurs on his character and on his person at that particular uh, time. And um, we now have to draw a line under them. But, but certainly we have to ask for e detailed explanations as to why it is that that happened. Daniela, originally, uh, you know, um, uh, you know, should have known better, but chalked up this enormous bill and we discussed that in Parliament and, and you know, she was, ta this, this, you know, she, she was talked to about that and then at a later stage she started having problems at the university with her colleagues and, and, and people not being willing to, to work with her, which ha can happen to anybody and therefore uh, the decision was taken to terminate her appointment in the university as a result of an, a number of issues uh, and, and she would have been terminated. In, in, including a bullying claim? She says that she, she made allegations against a, a government minister of bullying. Well, uh, you know, this is all a very subjective thing. One of the things about bullying is that if you are doing something wrong and I tell you off, you can feel bullied, uh, you know. Uh, but I am telling you that, that there were issues there that led to the termination of her employment and then uh, we decided in the cabinet that uh, you know, we wanted to give her an opportunity to do something else rather than leave her to try uh, and get a job in, in the job market and we effectively created a post for her that never existed and a job that is no longer... Uh, feasible to keep going in the constraints that we have when you know we have had to make cuts in things that are not absolutely necessary and what she was doing was not absolutely necessary.